On top of all the baseball and softball state championships tomorrow, it's also day one of the high school state track and field meet, it says in a stadium. We introduced you to wheelchair superstar athlete Grant Pierce a few years ago when he thrust himself on both the state and national scene. Now, Pierce is a senior, and he says he's going to try and soak in everything he can in his final high school meet. KSN's Asia Simone Smith has this week's competitive drive. I'm really just looking at PR, do my best because I know I'm going to have a lot of people out there watching me. Grant Pierce has drawn many crowds throughout his impressive high school track career. Just the fact that he is out here and gaining this attention, what it does is it shows other kids with disabilities you can be a part of a team, you can you can be treated as an equal, you can be involved. I really wanted to make something of myself, make a name for myself, so that's what I just reminded myself of before every single workout. That goal accomplished, claiming state records in the 100, 400, and 1600, and a national record in the 3200. He's as top tier as any other top tier athlete can be. He, he knows what he's capable of, and. When he sets his goals, he will work until that goal is met and then pick the next goal. Breaking records and barriers for inclusivity in high school sports. Earlier this season, he became the first wheelchair athlete to ever compete at the Kansas Relays. In the future, they're going to try and open it up to more events for wheelchairs. Everyone has the right to compete. Everyone has the right to be an athlete. And I think everyone should have the same opportunities that are given to other people. Now looking to inspire at the next level with a scholarship to the University of Illinois. They passed a bill for wheelchair athletes to be able to compete at the NCAA circuit, so I'll be at uh, NCAA meets and NCAA championships. Pierce sees himself winning gold in an international competition, a vision that wouldn't exist without his high school teammates. The inclusiveness and the amount of fun that I've just had going to high school meets, there's no other place like it really. Enjoying it all for one last meet. Here for you, Asia Simone Smith, KSN Sports. I think he's on uh, watch to maybe break a couple more state records oh, tomorrow. Probably, yeah. I wouldn't and, doubt it. Yeah. And it's fun that he said, you know, it's beyond the competition. It's fun, too. And yeah, so absolutely. you get just both of that, too, from a student and an athlete, and it's cool to see that. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. All right, Zach, thanks. We'll be right back.